guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a simple zoom circle with Sony Vegas 14. Now the end result should be something like this. This is actually very simple to do and without any further ado, let's start it. Uh, for this part we, for this project you actually need about 4 to 5 simple steps. Uh, first, firstly you want the designated video that you want, you copy it. You in insert new video track, you paste the video and remove the volume, remove the track with the secondary volume. Now, this is because it will actually double the volume and make it really annoying. Now, you select the part where you want the video to start with the circle. So, in this part, I want it here where I start shooting on the guy. I remove the unnecessary f uh, starting point. And go to the ending point. So something something around here. I remove the ending point again. And let's start it. So first, what you want to do is go to your video FX, search for cookie cutter, drag the center or the default one to the secondary clip, and. I know the exact size I want, so it's something around 125. That's all I need. Now, you go to Punt Crop Event, you zoom in, this should do. And next, you go to the truck motion. With the truck motion, you actually you just move it out of the way. Move the circle to the designated spot. So in my case, I like it on something somewhere top right, top right side. After doing that, you go to back, back to your paint cut to the cutter and move the center of the video to the designated point where you want, for example, in airsoft videos where the BB hits. So in my case, it's something around here. So the y, X center and Y center, I move it a little bit to the right and up. Now, just to test it, we can actually close it at the beginning. that most of the BBs are actually right to the center of the screen, the zoom. So this will be all it for the video, it's actually how to make. So all you have to do now is just to render with your designated uh, project settings, in my case it's 180 by 60, and just render it. Well I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial and see you next time.